Hello, this is Joe Pearson, the project planner for this application. This is a request to the Planning Commission to approve a special use permit to allow for alcohol sales at the Pizza Chief restaurant located at 2550 North Vineyard Avenue. The special use permit would allow for the sale of beer and wine for both on-site and off-site consumption with a Type 41 ABC license. This would include the sale of beer and wine through delivery along with other food items. The applicant is requesting to be able to sell beer and wine between the hours of 11 a.m. and 11 p.m. However, to allow for additional flexibility as market conditions change, the recommended hours by staff are 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. daily. The building permits for the Vineyard Square Shopping Center were issued in 1990 with the building being constructed over the course of the following two years. The original zone clearance to allow for the operation of the Pizza Chief restaurant was approved in 2005 with the current owner taking over in 2010. As shown in the map, the project is located in the northern part of the city at the corner of Vineyard Avenue and Ventura Boulevard. The Pizza Chief restaurant is located within the Vineyard Square Shopping Center, which contains two buildings totaling approximately 17,000 square feet. The existing restaurant is located in a 940 square foot tenant space on the, in the building on the north side of the property, as shown in the image. The Pizza Chief restaurant is within the land use designation of general commercial and the zoning designation of general commercial, both of which allow for restaurants. The sale of alcoholic beverages is permitted in the C2 zone subject to the approval of a special use permit. As shown in the prior slide, the project is surrounded by commercial uses with the Viarta Market to the north and east, the Wendy's to the west, and another commercial center to the south. The nearest open school is the Rio Vista School, located approximately 0.6 miles north of the project site. Also north of the shopping center is a closed elementary school site, which is also the location of the approved Rio Habana mixed use project. Currently shown is the restaurant floor plan, which identifies the locations in which the beer and wine will be stored along with other goods. The serving area for on-site consumption is limited due to the size of the restaurant as shown in the floor plan and image. The on-site seating is limited to a small bar area along the front of the tenant space. Pursuant to the police report provided in attachment D to the staff report, the crime rate within 1,000 feet of the site is 35, 30.5% of the average for commercial properties citywide. No safety concerns were noted by the beat coordinator or neighboring businesses, so the site is not considered to be a policing problem and the proposed alcohol sales as conditioned would not create a policing problem. According to the police report, there are no establishments of the same type located within 1,000 feet of the subject property. There is one establishment located within 350 feet of the subject property, which is the Viator Market, that currently operates with a Type 20 ABC license, which allows for off-site sales. There's another establishment located between 350 feet and 1,000 feet of the of the subject property, which is the El Rio Oxnard Market that also operates with a Type 20 ABC license. The police department has determined that as there's only one other alcohol establishment within 350 feet of the applicant's site and it is of a different license type, there is no undue concentration by local or state standards. The project 
is located within the El Rio neighborhood, which is mostly located outside of the city of Oxnard's incorporated boundaries, and abuts the El Rio West neighborhood, which is within the city of Oxnard's incorporated boundaries. Notices of the community workshop meeting were mailed to all property owners within the El Rio and El Rio West neighborhoods. The applicant also provided notice on the project site with a brief description of the project and contact information. The community workshop was conducted on November 16, 2020, and no members of the public attended the virtual workshop. Also, several nearby business operators were contacted and interviewed regarding the business's request to sell alcohol. Each person interviewed stated that the operators of the pizza chief were good neighbors and had no objections to the selling of alcoholic beverages. The project would be subject to various conditions of approval provided in the attached project resolution. Some of the key conditions include conditions 13 and 14, which requires training for those involved in the sale or serving of alcoholic beverages as well as condition 15, which limits the hours of alcohol sales um, to the recommended hours of 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. Also, condition 37 requires a surveillance system for the restaurant. Condition 54, which requires the sale of alcoholic beverages to be accompanied by food items, and lastly, condition 55, which requires that all deliveries of alcoholic beverages be completed within one hour of closing, which would require that all deliveries be completed by 12 midnight. The project would be exempt under CEQA as it is an existing facility and no physical changes are proposed. Also, the site will continue to operate as a restaurant, which is a permitted use in the C2 zone. Notice of the Planning Commission hearing has been posted on the site and mailed to surrounding property owners. Based on the information provided in this presentation and the associated staff report, staff recommends that the Planning Commission approve the project as submitted, finding that the project is exempt under CEQA section 15301 for existing facilities and approve the resolution for planning and zoning permit number 251007, subject to the findings and conditions provided.